playing a ukulele. Normally I play flute, but uh, sometimes I, I like to shake things up a little bit, especially I've been fe if I've been feeling a little down, which unfortunately I have lately. You know, there's a lot going on in the world right now. And uh, um, I've realized that I have not been doing a good job of practicing what I preach. Um, I, I realized lately that uh, there are certain expectations that I've been really attached to lately. Expectations about how I feel things should be, how I, I want things to be, or um, I attach, you know, certain outcomes with how I should feel about myself. Like, if this happens, then I can feel good about myself. And I just kind of wanted to share that with you all. Um, it's, it's something that I'm, I'm sure a lot of you are experiencing right now, too. Um, when life isn't going the way we expect it to, then certain emotions come up. And certain emotions can have a tendency to, to drain our energy, especially if they're, you know, uh, anger emotions or sadness emotions um, or frustration emotions. So anyway, I just wanted to share with you that I've been realizing and reflecting that I've been attached to certain outcomes in my life and um, had to remind myself about some of the tools that I really promote, especially on my Hero's Journey uh, five-week group coaching experience, which is coming up here in, in the next few days. Um, and what I really encourage my participants to look at is uh, what kind of awareness do you have around expectations in your life? Uh, can you accept everything just as it is? Because when you can, you can start to find some relief. And then we work on focusing on um, being in the process of our life rather than focusing on any kind of end product. Um, because life is a journey. You know, that's all it is, is an opportunity for us to learn about ourselves, learn from our mistakes, and learn how to become the best versions of ourselves as we can, no matter what's happening around us. So, on this journey of life, wouldn't you like some company? Um, that That's one of the things that's so great about the group coaching experience, is that you get to do this with some other people. So, the next Hero's Journey is starting this Sunday, October 18th at 1 p.m. And we will go for five weeks um, every Sunday through um, November 15th. And uh, if you want to register, you can do so on my website, www.tess-miller.com. Information is below this video. Um, I'd love to have you join us, but space is limited, so register today to reserve your spot on this journey, and I will be happy to connect with you. Anyway, I'm going to get back to doing what I'm doing, so uh, have a good day. I'm going to sit right down and write my 